you have a choice to receive it. But I can tell you whether you receive it or not, this is going to the top. The question is not do you want to be a part of it, do you want to be a pop, part of the next revolution that's coming. So let me tell you why, and then I'm going to run through these slides. Is that okay? Yes. Timing is everything, everything comes in shifts. Do you agree with that? Yes. yes. Recessions come like every eight years. Uh -huh. The last recession was 2008. What year is this? <laughs> you can tell because there's always a sign to a recession. <coughs> like Macy's closing. Ms. Martin did a good job with that. Yeah. And that was okay, but when Walmart closed yeah, right. one of those stores, yeah. it wasn't the 200 stores, it's the 200,000 suppliers that supply the stores who will now have to downsize. That creates a recession. Right. Now when a recession happens, all owners start to pull back. Mm -hmm. And they look at people who cost them too much. And they start to lay them off. So the older gets let go first. So if you don't own, you have a good chance of changing your career over the next 24 months. Yes. The second thing that creates a change in economics is a presidential election. Is that this year? Yes. Yes. Because every president must bring in his or her own brand of economics. So you have two major factors going on this year. You can't stay the same. You have to prepare. We call it dig your well before you're thirsty. Yes. Now one thing that will happen every 30 days you lovely people will pay your bills. <laughs> so why this makes so much sense because during recessions you pay bills. When things are great you pay bills. But if you're not getting paid back on your bills, you're missing and living in the richest community in the world, which is yours. Let that sit for a minute. Because every community has people who pay bills. So if you look at some of these commercials, some of those commercials look like some of you. Because they know how much you use your services. So the whole basis of violence for people who have seen this for the first time is let you get paid back on what you're paying out. If you don't understand this, understand every time you pay a bill, some part of that bill has advertising money in it. We won't run a radio ad, we won't run a TV ad, we will give you the advertising money. So you get to pay yourself. When I talk to ministers, any ministers in the room? Great. When I talk to ministers, sir, how are you? How many people do you have that you connect to? Quite a lot. Do they all pay bills? How much is coming back as a monthly donation to your church? Then we need to talk. Is that okay? All right. <laughs> and this is the same, right? That most churches are built on tithes and offering. In most churches, there's over 3,000 churches closing per year. And if I really showed it to you, it's per month. Because tithing and offering is going down, and ministers are stuck in the pulpit way past the time God says retire. Right. Because most ministers don't have a retirement program or life insurance program. So if I can just release that strain on my brothers and sisters, then we can be free to do what we're called to do, which is to lead people to success. That makes sense? Yes. So, but I'm going to 